Hello! If you've seen my last video, you know that I upgraded the battery in my Dell G5 SE laptop from the measly 51 watt hour factory fitted one to a somewhat better 68 watt hour battery. In this video, therefore, we will be taking a look at just how much of a difference this made to the battery life in the real world. The new battery is one third larger than the old one, but the question is, does this translate into a one third longer battery life? Well, that's what we're going to be finding out in this video. The new battery was ordered directly from Dell for a quite reasonable £35.76 plus VAT, that's about $50 US before tax. Given this price, I expected that the new battery would be refurbished, so I was pleasantly surprised by the reported wear level of just 0.1%. For comparison, the old battery had a wear level of 1.2% as reported by HW Info 64 this isn't a significant amount of wear by any means, and the Dell Power Management app still reported the battery health as excellent. However, I was quite surprised that this much wear had occurred in the little over two months that I'd owned this laptop, especially since I have the power management set for primarily AC use, which is supposed to extend the battery lifespan if you always have the laptop connected to power which mine has been since I've been stuck in lockdown since the laptop arrived. Perhaps battery wear happens in sort of a bell curve, with lots of wear occurring early on before levelling out later on. The irony of my upgrading the battery of a laptop that I never use away from the wall isn't lost on me, but my current use could be just be a sign of the times and my usage could change once we're allowed back outside once again. Anyway, before running the battery test, I changed the battery settings in Dell Power Manager to standard to allow the batteries to charge to their full potential. The test performed was the playback of YouTube videos, specifically a 100 hour countdown timer, so that I could see how long the batteries lasted. So, let's cue the montage. And the results are in! The 51 watt hour battery lasted a pathetic 3 hours and 45 minutes, but this is about what I expected. And the 68 watt hour battery lasted for, drum roll please, 6 hours and 13 minutes. Greatly exceeding my expectations, that's almost two thirds increase in battery life over the old battery. I can't explain why a battery that's only one third larger lasted two thirds longer. None of this makes sense. Um, <laughs> none of the settings were changed between the tests and the 1.2% wear level of the old battery can't account for a difference of this amount. I'm not complaining though, as this is good news for me, but I guess it will remain a mystery. I'm particularly glad given the difficulties I experienced installing this new battery, which you can see in my previous video. Anyway, I don't think there's much more to be said on this matter than that, so I'm going to leave it there. I'm not sure if I'll be able to keep up posting videos as frequently as I have been recently over the past few weeks, as I've got university exams and assignments due in soon. But I will be back! So, as always, if you enjoyed this video please like, comment and subscribe. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one.